Hey guys, Milkstool here, how are you? So the new weekly event has just dropped. It is Orbs and Heroic Miracle this week. The reward for Heroic Miracle, if you complete it, is Faithblade, which is kind of a, eh, <laughs> it's not really a must-have light hero. So I'm obviously just gonna complete it because I'm only one dark hero off. Uh, I, I, I just basically want the five orbs. I don't really want the copy of Faithblade. I think they will re rework Faithblade at some point down the track, and so I will definitely save copies of Faithblade. I have one other in my bag. Uh, I don't intend to use it as food. I'll save this other one just in case at some point in time they decide to rework Faithblade. Fingers crossed they do. I, it, it looks like they're going through a round of reworking just old heroes right now. So we've just obviously had Sia, uh, and everyone now is now aware that Sigmund is getting a rework as well and then there are talks that Jar is the next person getting a rework and so there's I think rather than creating new heroes they're just refreshing the old heroes again so then they, they become uh, relevant and I guess that makes sense because it's it's probably a lot easier to rework uh, an old hero <laughs> than it is to create a new one because in reworking an old hero obviously you don't need to redo the artwork you just need to muck around with the uh, the powers that they have and, and the the levels uh, of, of those powers. And certainly, uh, from a gameplay, gameplay perspective, the more heroes you have, the harder it is to get copies because you've just expanded the universe from which you can get uh, certain kinds of heroes uh, and to the point where sometimes it might just be really, really hard to get enough copies to E5 a hero. Uh, and so uh, the more heroes you have obviously because the pool is expanded and so every time you do a random drop or, or summons those odds go down uh, and it's spread across more heroes so that's why I think they're probably focusing more on just reworking old heroes rather than making new heroes otherwise if you have too many heroes it's just going to be near impossible to get enough copies to, to build that hero to, to E5 anyway that's Heroic Miracle The if you complete all of it you get a Faith Blade for the completing the, the Prophet Orbs, the hero for completing one cycle is Oberon, who's a very decent and very much in the meta uh, hero right now. So Oberon's obviously very useful for either a Redemption Aura, a Rainbow Aura, or <laughs> if you have enough copies and you might have seen uh, some videos going around, the fact that uh, having lots of Oberons makes a team insanely OP and three E5 Oberons undefeatable right now undefeatable or very very hard to defeat the other thing worth mentioning is uh the value packages uh, i didn't notice this but they've actually if you scrutinize it uh, they've actually reverse the order of value used to be the cheapest value package was the best value in terms of cost per profit orb but now they've actually flipped it now the most expensive orb pack is actually the best value in terms of cost per orb and that in real life generally makes sense the more of something you buy the cheaper it should be but for some strange reason in the old days this was not the case they had way distorted values and i think they obviously change the value that you get from the value packages in terms of making the highest package the best value I think one to encourage people to spend more, which <laughs> isn't great for people that used to buy the cheapest pack and they're probably like really angry now at, at them changing the, the value package. So we'll see how it goes. If they find that they're not making more money, which is I think why they've done this, they'll, all revert, they'll probably revert to the old value system in terms of what you get uh, for the cheapest package and the most expensive package. But if it works and they find that people are spending more, they're obviously going to stay this way. My tip if you're a whale <laughs> or, or, or uh, a selective whale like I am is just definitely snag out all the value packages. You used to get 25 orbs as at the most expensive package, which is about 100 US dollars. Now, I think you get 33. You get eight more orbs, and that's a big, big deal. That's like a one-third, 33% increase or, or more uh, without, uh, just out of the blue. Uh, I, and so it'll be interesting to see if they revert. If they revert, <laughs> you're going to wish you bought the, 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 the most expensive package. Anyway, that's the value packages. There's also some new funky uh, forest treasure type event, which is a multi-buy type package and that's phenomenal value so you should definitely buy that but what i was going to do in this video because i know you all love watch 
watching me orb. <laughs> I'm gonna do 80 orbs. I might do 160. Right now I have 145 orbs, so I'm obviously 15 short and I would need to buy a value package in order to get to 160 and I may very well do that. Uh, undecided, undecided. I did hit 40 for subscribers, the big 4 If I hit 50 subscribers <laughs> over the next week, I'll do it. I'll, I'll do another 80 orbs. But in this first instance, I, I might just do 80 orbs and see what I get. So I'm gonna orb into light and dark because I need a couple of dark copies or food to 10 star my DA, after which I don't need any more dark food. And then after that, I'll dump into forest because I'm trying to build up my Oberon. So I'm gonna spend 80 orbs. I need you guys to watch out for you, make sure that I don't go over. So 80 orbs, let's, let's go. So here we go, 10. And my luck is terrible. Okay, so <laughs> I was gonna say my luck is terrible. Things have finally turned. That is my first decent hero having orbed into light and dark for a while. A uh, mim, wow, amazing. Okay, so that's it. I'm never gonna get another good hero again from light and dark, not for a while. So let's do another 10 and see what we get. Yeah, there we go. I actually need, I, I almost regret getting a Mim because I can't use Mim for food. That's the problem. <laughs> He's relevant again in the meta now that they've sort of unbending will. They've just capped it at four debuffs uh, that unbending will can, can do. And so that's made Mim relevant again. Anyway, that's, that's light and dark. I might just do another 10 to make it 30 and see what we get. Yeah, see, <laughs> now, it's, now it's completely shite. <laughs> I'm not getting any food. Uh, I'm just getting a bunch, a bunch of rando uh, four-star light and dark shards, and then the, the five-star shards, and the, 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 the spirits, the, the four-star spirit shards. Useless. Uh, do I want to do it again? Do I want to tempt fate? I know I'm just going to get junk, but I, I'll do it again. I can't help myself. Again, see, I'm just getting light copies. I don't need light copies. I need dark copies to, to one, finish out Heroic Miracle and to complete my, uh, my DA, to get enough food to complete my DA. Anyway, let's do forest. So we did 40 in light dark. Let's see what we get with forest. I don't need any copies of any heroes in forest. I think I have enough to do everything. I just need food, so. There we go, very good. So we got uh, Dragon Slayer, five star, fantastic. Let's do another 10. Yes, we got Thale as a five star, that's fantastic. I will take that. Another 10. Ah, more five star, fantastic. We got Edgar, or Chief, uh, and Head Striker, fantastic. Lovely food. And last 10. Okay, we got Rat Boy, Starlight. Fantastic, five star food. And we'll just snag up the goodies. That's it guys. <laughs> I'm not gonna spend any more unless we hit 50 subscribers and I know that's a very, very hard thing to do. I might spend more orbs uh, when the monthly event, my monthly event resets in a couple of days uh, simply because I want to build up my heroes only after the monthly event reset so then I get the rewards. So I might I might spend more orbs then, but if I do, I'll definitely do a video on that. Thanks for watching guys. Have a great day.